Good morning, Gemini. How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing good. Welcome aboard the Cosmic Chariot. I'm going to be your tour reader today. My name is Tyler. How are you guys doing? All right, so Gemini, this is going to be your monthly reading for the month of April. Not all messages will resonate, but take all resonates and leave, and leave the rest behind. For that being said, Gemini, let's get right into it. So Gemini, we're going to be shuffling the deck. Uh, the after tarot deck two more times now we're going to divide the deck and see what's in your ruins what ruins you guys got so we'll be using the ruins the after tarot deck and uh, the chakra energy card deck all right so here we go cool 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 all right so at the bottom of the deck, you have the tower card. So there could be some chaos that you are going through. It was in reverse, so uh, you could be getting over chaos during this time. You have, you have flow that jumped out, and you have standstill. So things could be you know at a standstill. So just go with the flow. You know whatever seems like it's working, go with that. Um, you do have the three of cups here in reverse so there could be some friendships that um aren't the best for you like maybe someone betrayed your trust and or maybe you're contemplating sending a message to one of your friends or one of your ex friends because you thought that they were your friends you thought they were helping you in all reality they were just keeping you stuck they weren't moving you forward in any way. They were nurturing you. They were caring about you. But if they were really caring about you, wouldn't they cut you down from this, you know, rope and stuff? Um, but they didn't. They just kept you there. They just kept you stuck. Um, and you're finding the strength to move forward, but you're having a hard time moving forward because you're stuck. And you... And because you can't move forward, because you are stuck, you can't move forward. So you gotta really find the strength within in order to move forward. Um, but really, you gotta go with the flow and do what feels right, not with, not anything. Don't force the situation, but also go with the flow, right? Um, you have the lovers card here, so you could be dealing with a soulmate or someone. Uh, potential could be coming towards you this is also your card Gemini um, so yeah you could be dealing with a Gemini Libra Leo and cancer um, okay okay so tell me more about this lovers card tell me more about the lovers card why is this lovers card lover's card here for gemini tell me more about the lover's card tell me more about this lover's card it could be that the person that is keeping you stuck is actually um the person that you're in a relationship with um but it doesn't have to be you do have the three of cups here so there could have been like a friend that was holding you back from your like your true potential um yeah so yeah you could be dealing with a sagittarius or a leo because you do have the king of wands in reverse and the queen of wands in reverse um you also have the four of wands which is the a meaning a relationship so you could have a relationship with a queen of wands or a king of wands they both came out so leo sagittarius um you could also have a open relationship so meaning there are multiple people involved or this could be you just needing to decide which person you want to go to um or which person you trust more so if your best friend is you know the king of wands and your relationship and your relationship is with the queen of wands which one are which side are you going to go towards? Are you going to go towards the King of Wands? Or are you going to go towards the Queen of Wands? Um, 
you know, maybe they're telling you some stories or just more about a situation that you don't really know about. Um, so, but there is some sort of connection here between you and this person. Uh, maybe you just, you just aren't sure what to do because you guys, uh, so they're both in reverse, the King of Wands and the Queen of Wands. So, maybe you guys are just not sure what you want to go towards, whether or not you want a relationship with this person. It does look like there is a good connection, but you're just not sure. You're not sure if you want to move forward or if you just want to, you know, move forward in a different direction. So, like I said, you have, you know, the lover's card here, which is soulmate. It's a really strong connection, um, but something's keeping you from moving forward, whether it's a friend telling you about gossip or drama that they've, uh, that this relation or this partner of yours has been in before. Maybe they know something that you don't, or maybe they're just trying to make you jealous or whatever. Um, something along those lines of communication, uh, Gemini, so just be careful of that. And this could be, this could resonate for you for uh, the end of March and in, into April, but this, but for my sake, I'm just saying April, just to keep it, you know, out there. All right. <laughs> so let's see a few more cards. So you got the four of pentacles. So it does look like there's going to be some changes happening in your life. Um, that could be financially. Uh, so maybe you have a work situation that you weren't uh, too proud of. It doesn't look like you're going to be winning if anytime soon when it comes to finances. So just make sure you pick the battles that you want to go towards um, and go with the flow. If you lose a job, you know, it's no big deal right now. I mean, it's a big deal right now because of what's everything is going on. Maybe you're really worried about money um, and you're trying to get enough money in order to move forward. And that could leave you feeling stuck and not sure what you're going to do in the future. Um, but don't let it drag you down because it's go It's basically just going to keep you stuck in one spot and it's not going to help move you forward in any direction that you choose to go in. Um, so just keep going with the flow, moving forward, um, because if you stay stuck, you're not going to get a victory out of this. You're just going to lose you know, money and knowledge and stuff like that. So... Keep moving forward, do what's best for you, and don't let anyone drag you down. Alright, so let's get into your chakra cards, or your energy cards, and see what energies you guys are dealing with during this time. Alright, 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 alright. So, for the, from this reading, I'm getting a lot of fire, water, and air. So, those are the energies that I'm seeing and the elements that I'm seeing so far. So yeah, yep, yep, yep. Uh, I see the heart chakra and a bit of the crown chakra as well. So your crown chakra may be a bit uh, blocked right now because, you know, the hanged man, you know, your, your crown chakra will be unblocked once the hanged man is in the upright or is in reverse. Because then the hanged man is enlightened and knows what's going on around it, around him. Instead, it's in, it's in the upright, so he's stuck and not really sure where to go, and he's not really enlightened right now, right? So, just keep that in mind. Uh, and I say heart chakra because you do have the lovers card here, and that's all about love and you know happiness. And yeah, you have relationships, you have business, and then you have friendships here. So um, just take it as it resonates and leave what don't. All right, so you have listening. Make sure you listen. Listen very carefully to your uh, messages and any divine wisdom that you are getting. Um, and make sure that's resonating with you. 
Um, and during this time, just really listen to what people have to say because they're going to be communicating their truth and um, you may misinterpret what they have to say and you may think, oh God, like all this is happening. Um, I need to prepare and in all reality, it's not as bad as you think and it actually is something completely different. So you gotta really uh, talk to your partner, really listen to what your partner has to say or any friendships, business, whatever it is. Really listen up and there will be divine communication coming towards you um, and when it comes to knowledge or just um, anything spiritual. Uh, so really pay attention to your dreams and focus on listening up. All right, uh, the spirit realm is going to be sending you knowledge, so be aware of that and um, keep your eyes open. All right, so Gemini, for that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this reading. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe. Namaste, I'll see you guys next time. Peace. And if you would like to follow me on Instagram or Twitter, the links will be down in the description below. I'll see you guys next time.